Greetings and thanks for joining us on our new program called Victory Videos. If you've just tuned our way, my name is Dave Dobbins and we've got some great music videos for you today from some of contemporary Christian music's greatest artists. Our purpose is to bring you the finest music videos that are available to you each and every week right here on Victory Videos. Today's program we've got good stuff from Randy Stonehill, Amy Grant, Mylon Lefevre, Philip Bailey, Petra, and David Meese. So if you've never seen our program before, I'd like to invite you to sit back and relax and get ready for some good music as we start out our first video for you today from Randy Stonehill from his album Love Beyond Reason. Here's Love Broke Through on Victory Videos.
does your head keep turning from the feelings turning deep inside of you? Tell me when your mind is racing, all the things you're chasing worth your while now. Tell me, don't you ever question why you're always guessing reasons for your life? Listen, there's no need to waver long ago the Savior died. your heart now you want to say you play it smart now why is up today and give him a little love tell me does the fear of losing keep your heart from choosing who has hold of you tell me have you felt the yearning deep inside a burning need for love now tell me, tell me can you sense the fighting hate is now igniting fear of love and you Listen, God is still here waiting You will move the hating part of you So don't run away You're headed nowhere Keep off the face You're gonna go ahead Keep alone Until you know their peace Turn back now Don't run away You want your heart now You wanna say You're not That was music from Amy Grant from her album, Age to Age and Don't Run Away. Before that, we heard music from Randy Stonehill and Love Broke Through. You know, if you've just been kind of passing through the, the dials on your television, you've come across us. We're Victory Videos, but we're here for a reason of sharing the love of Jesus Christ. You know, Amy Grant in that last song was singing about Don't Run Away. What does she mean by that? You know, sometimes... Uh, we go through difficult situations in our life, and it's, it's easy to run away from our problems. It's easy to run away from our friends. But, you know, God is there for you to change the, the hardness of your heart inside, to be able to help you to deal with the problems that come up in your life. And we here at Victory Videos are here to present you with good music videos every week. And we have got a good message underneath all of this for you, and that's the love of Jesus Christ. And so... If you've never seen a program like this, I invite you to call your friends up on the phone and tell them that it's on every week at this time, Victory Videos. We've got more to come right now. Some good, good stuff coming to you from Mylon Lefevre and Broken Hearts. This is from his album, Brand New Start. This is called Stranger to Danger, right here for you on Victory Videos.
be a vast expanse of desert or rocky maze. You can be within a few hundred feet and still miss it. So it helps a great deal if you know approximately where to look. This is Cliff Robertson for Civil Air Patrol. If you file a flight plan, and are forced down, Civil Air Patrol could be searching for you within hours. With no flight plan, it might be days before anybody even knows you're missing, so play it smart. File a flight plan. I'm General Chuck Yeager. An exciting and rewarding aerospace adventure awaits young people between the ages of 13 and 18. Contact your local Civil Air Patrol. That was Mylon Lefevre and Stranger to Danger on Victory Videos. My name is Dave Dobbins. If you just tuned in, we're glad to have you with us on our program. You know, Mylon was singing about being a stranger to danger. I think kind of in my heart he was saying how he didn't want to be close to the things that are not good. And in the Bible it says to love those things which are good and to hate those things which are bad. That's a simple message, but it tells us in our heart that we need to reach out to the things that God loves the things that are good for us in our life. So uh, I think there's a good message in there. Did you enjoy that? I really did, too. I hope you did. Right now, we've got music coming up from Philip Bailey. Now, Philip used to be with the secular group Earth, Wind, and Fire, which some of you may remember. And he went out on his own several years ago, and he's been doing great in the, in the Christian music industry. Sings real high. So you try to sing along with him. You have to have a high voice. This is from his album, The Wonders of His Love. And this is called, I Want to Know You. So sit back and enjoy Philip Bailey on Victory Videos.
That was Philip Bailey on Victory Videos. You've heard that name a few times today, but I want to keep telling you about it if this is the first time you've turned it, tuned in. And that was called I Want to Know You. I Want to Know You. Uh, it's about Jesus, you know, about how we need to reach out and, and need to accept Jesus into our heart, let him lead our lives. And I think uh, God is saying, I want to know you too. So if that has touched your heart, reach down inside and find the reason why you haven't been reaching out to Jesus Christ today. We're going to take a little break, but when we come back, we've got more music coming to you from Petra from their Beat the System album, David Meese and Amy Grant, and some more music from Randy Stonehill. So keep it right here on Victory Videos. Poll recently reported that 40% of the American public have gone through a born-again experience. They also reported that a staggering 96% of all teenagers believe in God. What has that got to do with what you are looking at now? Everything. You are witnessing gospel music in the 1980s. No longer the traditional gospel stereotype, today's gospel music includes rock and roll, rhythm and blues, jazz, and even heavy metal. The proof is in the numbers. Gospel music revenues topped $176 million in 1985. It is bigger than both jazz and classical. Major labels like Capitol, CBS, and A&M are signing gospel acts and creating gospel divisions. The industry's biggest name, Amy Grant, is repeatedly knocking out gold and platinum albums. Her recent number one pop hit with Peter Cetera, Next Time I Fall, appears to be only the beginning. Grammy Award winner Michael W. Smith, gospel music's most popular male vocalist, is another artist whose success has attracted the attention of an even larger audience. A primary player in Amy's rise to fame, Smith started out as a keyboardist in her band. Eventually, as a writer, he would not only co-author two of Amy's biggest solo pop hits, he would also give shape and focus to the previously undefined sound of Christian rock. New markets are opening up for gospel artists like Grant and Smith. Today, their music is enjoying a mainstream acceptance in not only America, but foreign markets as well. That's encouraging. I think, I think this is just the beginning. I think we're going to, I think we have a drive. Uh, we've just made up our minds, we're going to go for it. American music owes a great deal to gospel music. It was the religious folk melodies of early Scotch-Irish immigrants that eventually evolved into today's country music. And it was the native music of African slaves combined with the religion of the New World that became the roots of rhythm and blues. So no matter what style, whether it's Grant's pop or Smith's rock, as long as man looks for a better life, he will look to the uplifting experience of gospel music. History has proven that. I grew up in a little church in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Back in the days when they were having the blackouts, okay? So I'm dating myself. You know about how old I am by that. Some of you were just a thought in the mind of God at that time. And we used to sing about the worthiness of God, but it didn't quite go like that, you know. Most created. It didn't go like that. Go calls that round mouth singing. She said, you got to make your mouth round to sing like that, you know. But we used to sing something like this. It would go like this. Worthy, worthy Lord, worthy, worthy Lord, worthy, worthy Lord, worthy, worthy Lord. God is worthy. God is worthy. God is worthy. Worthy, worthy, 
Hi, and welcome back to Victory Videos. I'm Dave Dobbins. You know, each week we're going to try to bring you the best uh, music videos that are available from Nashville, uh, from Texas, and California, wherever we can get our hands on them. And these videos have special messages. Uh, for some of you parents out there who, who are looking for your kids to have an alternative to music, and for some of you kids who are getting tired of some of the music that's out there in the secular world and you want to find something that's going to be a little different for you, I'd like to invite you to... Uh, Tell your friends about Victory Videos. We're here for you each and every week to bring you uh, the greatest message behind the music. And the message is real important. It's a way that can change our lives. So in addition to that, every week we will, uh, well, not every week, but some weeks we will have special artists from uh, right here in the greater Cincinnati, northern Kentucky area who are making Christian music uh, headlines right here in our area like we did last week. And uh, in addition to that, we will be having some national artists um, coming through our city, and we will bring them to you. So uh, keep tuned right here. We've got more music for you right now. Would you like that? I would, too. Let's sit back and get ready to listen to music from Petra. This is from their Beat the System album with the song with the same title. This is Petra on Victory Videos.
going to beat the system. I like that song, Petra, on Victory Videos. Hope you enjoyed that. Let's sit back and uh, take a listen now to a gentleman who's been playing the piano for a lot of years. He's a good family man who's been here in the, uh, uh, actually in uh, northern Cincinnati area. If you remember some of you, we had some concerts here called Sunshine Festival up in Hamilton, Ohio. David Meese is his name. He's been here. He's got a lot of friends in this area. And uh, David Meese has uh, a tremendous, tremendous ministry. Uh, plays the piano quite well, but he also has a song, a singing voice that uh, will really minister to your heart. So let's sit back and listen to this song from David Meese from his Candle in the Rain album. This is called All in God's Creation on Victory Videos. That was David Meese from his album 
candle in the rain, and all is God's creation. I hope that ministered to your heart, and we hope you're really being blessed by Victory Videos today. We've got some good music coming for the rest of the program. And also, if you've been blessed by our program, you know we don't ask for any money. We don't ask for anything, but we would like to know if you've been blessed. And if so, please write us to Victory Videos, Care of Fellowship of Believers Church, 6800 Hazel Court, Florence, Kentucky. And if you have some special needs with inside your heart that you feel that you want to talk to us about, feel free to call us Monday through Friday during normal business hours at 371-9988. And somebody will be there to pray with you. I'd like to thank you for joining us today. We've got more music to come. Right now, let's sit back and enjoy a song from the number one female Christian artist of the day. In 1989, that's Amy Grant from her album Age to Age, which was a multi-million dollar seller. And this is a song, Don't Run Away, on Victory Videos. Grant and <laughs> don't run away on victory videos I like that song 
she has really, really come a long way. You know, she believed in God. She believed that God had a plan for her life. Do you have a plan? Do you know that God has a plan for your life? You can see what God has done for Amy Grant. has brought her, her from a, a little girl playing guitar in churches to being a, a big national uh, Christian recording artist, be able to share the music of Jesus Christ. But you know, that may not be that important to you. It's not that important to me. But you know what is important? That is if you've reached out and gotten a hold of Jesus Christ in your life. Have you? If you haven't, I'd like to invite you to uh, make a change in your life today. You know, Jesus died on the cross for our sins over 2,000 years ago so that we could receive redemption in our life. We could be forgiven of our sins. What does that mean? That means that we can look to him as the, the creator of our lives, the creator of our world, and also to be the savior of our lives. Is he the savior of your life today? If he's not, I'd like to invite you to come in, sit a little closer to the to the TV set. We're going to give you an opportunity in just a few minutes to invite Jesus Christ into your life. Okay? Was that okay with you? Great. Let's move on with another great song. And uh, this is from Randy Stonehill. He's the one to start out our program. This is from Celebrate This Heartbeat album. And a very good song called A Still Small Voice on Victory Videos. This is a test of the disaster warning system. This is only a test.
Welcome back to Victory Videos. That was Randy Stonehill, the still small voice. You know, sometimes uh, I really like that because, you know, sometimes it makes me uh, think about the times when I have that little still small voice that's inside of me that tells me little things that I should and shouldn't do. A lot of people call that uh, your conscience. You know, but a lot of other people call that God's Holy Spirit speaking to you through from his spirit to yours. You have that. You know, sometimes I do. And I realize that, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, I realize that a lot of times that's God talking to me. Well, that's what I believe because, you know, I have Jesus Christ in my heart. Do you have Jesus in your heart today? How many times have you been asked that question? Maybe never. Well, Jesus can talk to you in that small, still voice inside of your heart. And very simply, all that you need to do is to invite him into your heart today. I'd like to invite you to take a few moments right now and put things down and everybody sit down and be quiet. Let's take a minute and let's do that right now. Let's get close with the Lord. Let's invite him into our heart. If this is the first time you've ever prayed this, pr prayed, pr prayed this prayer, it's easy for me to say, this is the very first time. Don't be nervous. This is real simple. You know, Jesus' love is simple for you and it's free. So let's go to the Lord. Heavenly Father, I just thank you for my brothers and sisters out there right now. And Lord, I pray that you will change hearts in Jesus' name. Now, brother and sister, repeat this prayer after me. Jesus, I am a sinner. Forgive me for my sins. I've made some mistakes. But I know that you can change me. Come into my heart, Jesus. Make me a new creature on you. Forgive me for my sins. And be the Savior of my life. In Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah. If you prayed that prayer for the first time, praise God. You know, you're now a child of the kingdom of God. And God's going to change you. He's going to fill you with his joy and his peace. And things are going to go, well, they're going to go good for you. But God doesn't say things are going to be perfect in your life. But, you know, we're going to be here each and every week bringing you good music and things that will help direct you in the right direction. But there is something else that you need to do. You need to call somebody and tell them that you've received Jesus Christ into your heart. Call a friend. But better yet, we'd like to invite you to call us at our church at Fellowship of Believers. You can call any church if you want. But since we're here for you, give us a call at 371-9988 during normal business hours during the week at Fellowship of Believers. Victory Videos is here for you each week because we love you and we care about you. Thanks for tuning in. We'll be, be here. We'll be here next time for you with more music videos, the finest in contemporary Christian music for you right here each and every week on Victory Videos. I'm your host, Dave Dobbins, saying remember to love somebody this week with the love of Jesus. And we'll see you next time on Victory Videos.